Yes, sir. People, I cannot stress that enough. When the kid's taking a pitch the wrong way, normally it's a wrong action. Now, after a bunch of drills, we're just gonna uh, do a few, a few frontos here with my, with my friend Luke. So we just hit the machine. So make sure after the machine, after we hit the machine, you understand that you have to time in my arm now, right? Over there with the machine, it was more like a quickness, clean your swing, trust, trust your, your speed. So now we're just gonna throw to you, but you're gonna hold that speed as long as you can, as long as you can with a good coil, okay? That's how you hold your speed. Do you wanna hold your speed in your front leg or in your back leg? Back leg, okay, good. I'm gonna throw a few so you can time me. Now, when you're on game, what are you supposed to do? When you're on game, when the pitcher is warming up and throwing, you need to stay, you need to get that, that little rhythm with your body, okay? That separation in the back leg and then land. Uh-huh. So normally when I'm, when my arm is in motion, that's when I start kind of, start coiling, okay? Okay. Staying back. All right, good. Let's hit. Better. See, in that one, you were more here in the back than the, the other one outside. Don't go get it. Just let it get deep and try to be in the same swing. The only difference is just let the ball get deep and turn you back where the ball is. Yes. I was better getting on plane with that pitch. Good. Outside pitch. Good job. Yes, sir. Good. Oof. I throw that fastball inside. You could be better with your more connection and quick turn. Oof. Out of boy. Yes, sir. Good, back to the middle. I like the fact that you're staying back, man. Good job, Baba. What happened here if I throw you this? Oh, good. That's what I want to see. Uh-huh, good. People, I cannot stress that enough. When the kid's taking a pitch the wrong way, normally it's a wrong action. Right there, he takes the pitch the right way and that allowed me to be more calm because I know he would not swing junks that much. The percentage of swinging junks, like balls in the ground, is because the action they take when they take a pitch. As soon as they take a, the pitch the wrong way, you throw another one, they may be gonna swing it. So, but when they take it the right way, I know the percentage of swinging bad pitches is gonna be less and less, okay? It's normally in the back leg, in the back leg with a, with a good control. I'm gonna throw a little curveball right here and see. You let it go the first uh -huh, time. good, you see? I throw a little curveballs without telling him. So I know he's staying back. Curveball. Oish, good. Let's play a game. No outs, nobody on base. Make sure your feet right, your feet right. You always, when you're there, you have to make your checklist, okay? Oh my God, single. Man on first. Good. One ball. Give me that. Ah, they passed through it. Crap. Don't get long, let's go. Man on first and second. Ooh. Full bases. Man, I'm going too easy on you. Hey, give me that strike. What are you trying to do, full bases, man? What is that? Lefty. Ah, just trying to intimidate you a little bit. Ah, Lord. Give me that, strike. Two strike, let's go, I got this one. I got this one, two strike, full bases. No outs. Oh, really? God. That was single? God. Good job, Papa. Let's do one more and we pick up, okay? Don't get big. Yeah, that's one because when I say one more, it can trick you. You're trying to do more than you need to. You've been doing good. 
Just one more, just imagine I don't say it, okay? Just call and do your thing, okay? You've been doing good, so one more, that don't mean hit the ball, uh, overpower your swing, you know? Just do your thing, be quick. Because that happens when you got full bases in the game, you want to do more than you need to, and then what happened? You strike out or whatever, right? Yes, that was better. You got it along in there. Just be quick. <laughs> 